Welcome to this course, which is called Mastering Python Packages, Organizing Files and Best Practices. If you follow this course, you'll be able to create and maintain high quality Python projects. And even if you use a specific frameworks, for example, Django or Flask or others, you'll be able to use these design patterns and best practices. We'll use as much built-in tools as possible and we'll see a full implementation of these tips through the MDTalk project. And then I'll put some uh, quizzes on YouTube. This is the course outline, the first part. So as you see, our two pages. So these will be more or less the number of videos you'll get. So probably less than 20. And uh, let's start. So we'll see Git, some uh, important tips. Then we'll see how to set up virtual environments. And we won't see PPM or Poetry, we'll see how to set up virtual environments using built-in tools. We'll see how to do, how to write requirements file. So usually it's requirement.txt, but we'll also see others. And uh, this is in bold because it's important. So we'll see how to build an API. We'll see some uh, uh, generic ways to build an API and some examples. And the same things with the uh, command line interface or CLI. We'll use arc parse for this, which is a standard Python library. We see how to write uh, uh, unit tests. This one is very important. We'll see the setup files. So uh, the usual setup.py, setup.cfg, and the pyproject.toml files. We'll see how to configure and run the unit test we've written here at point number six. We'll see why we need to write a make file why it is important. Of course, the repository, the project will have a readme file. We'll also see how to write uh, the documentation to Sphinx, which is the de facto standard for Python documentation. We'll see several software licenses and which one to choose. And also the pre-commit environment. We'll set it up uh, and uh, we'll see all the various important hooks. Also the father, we'll see what it is and why it is important. It is connected to the testing part. We'll see this one it will be a quick video for the Markdown community files, which is especially useful for GitHub at the moment. We'll see, okay, this one is uh, one of the most important points, the app release cycle. So how to do releases and uh, how to publish them, where to publish them, how to sign uh, the files, etc. Finally, the conclusions. See you soon with the next, uh, with the first video. So the Git important tips video. Bye bye.